Aren't Tsamoru's Micronesian? Geographically speaking, yes. Tsamoru's are Micronesian because the Marianas, the homeland of the Tsamoru's, is located in the region of Micronesia. Yet there are many Tsamoru's, especially on Guam, who don't consider themselves Micronesian. And the reason is because Tsamoru's traditionally understand the term Micronesians to refer to the people of the U.S. freely associated states, especially the Federated States of Micronesia, rather than in a geographic sense. We must understand that self-identifying as Micronesians is a relatively new idea. The labels Micronesia and Micronesians were imposed by colonial forces and historically, the peoples of Micronesia never referred to themselves as Micronesians. It was not until the 1950s and 60s that we see some native inhabitants of Micronesia particularly the political leaders of the trust territory of the Pacific Islands actively self-identifying themselves as Micronesians. And this was done for strategic political purposes in negotiations with the US. And some leaders, such as future president of the Federated States of Micronesia, Toshiwo Nakayama, emphasize a common Micronesian identity in order to push for a united self-governing Micronesia. Guam was never a part of the TTPI, so there was no reason for Guam's political leaders to emphasize a common Micronesian identity. Rather, Guam's leaders emphasized an American identity, at least in rhetoric, because they wanted the economic benefits of being aligned with the US. And the Northern Marianas broke away from the TTPI in 1976. Nakayama's dream was partially realized with the creation of the Federated States of Micronesia, which comprises of Yap, Chuk, Ponape, and Koshrai. What's important to note is that this newly political entity contains the name Micronesia in it, which institutionalized the connection between the label of Micronesia to the citizens of the FSM. And this is significant because when the Compact of Free Association Agreements took effect in 1986, one of the provisions allowed for the visa-free movement of COFA migrants into the United States and its territories. And within a few years of the signing, hundreds of COFA migrants, primarily from the FSM, migrated to Guam. And subsequently, the term Micronesians entered in the common vocabulary of the people of Guam, who labeled the newly arrived COFA migrants who mostly came from the Federated States of Micronesia as Micronesians. So if you were to ask Tsamorus, especially older Tsamorus, if they are Micronesian, they will most likely tell you no, because they are not understanding the term Micronesian in the same strict geographic and pan-Micronesian solidarity sense that you do, but rather from their traditional understanding that Micronesians refer to the peoples of the US freely associated states. It would be like if you were to ask people from Canada if they are American. They will most likely tell you no because the term American is traditionally understood to refer to the citizens of the United States of America, despite both countries being a part of the same geographic region. Sadhu's Masi for watching. Guahusipulan Esta.